Hi, my name is Dilek Erz and I'm a Bladed Technical Support Engineer at DNME. In this video, we will discuss the different workflows available to run fixed offshore wind turbine simulations in SESAM and Bladed. The combination of these two software offers a complete, intuitive and user-friendly process for the design of the wind turbines, in addition to ultimate strength and fatigue analysis of offshore wind turbine substructures. SESAM and Bladed include the essential functionality to design fixed offshore wind structures from conceptual studies to detailed analysis. Bladed and SESAM can be used in a single workflow in two ways, either using an integrated design approach or using a super element analysis. The integrated analysis workflow is a fully coupled workflow. For the integrated approach, the modeling of the substructure and tower is done in SESAM, which is then converted into a bladed format and linked to a wind turbine model in bladed. A combined wind and wave loads analysis is then performed in bladed, after which the resulting forces and moments are extracted for every beam in the structure. These results are then converted into SESAM format, where it's possible to perform fatigue and extreme analysis. The super element analysis is on the other hand, is a sequentially coupled simulation. The modeling of the substructure is done in SESAM and both the model and the wave loads are then reduced into a super element and linked to a wind turbine and tower model in bladed. This is followed by a wind load analysis in bladed, after which the forces and moments are extracted at an interface point. These loads are then applied to the model in SESAM together with the wave loads, allowing you to run the structural analysis. The post-processing is finally performed in SESAM, where fatigue and extreme analysis are run. The super element workflow has two key advantages compared to a fully integrated analysis in Bladed, which are the foundation designer can share their design for aeroelastic analysis without needing to share the jacket design details with the wind turbine designer or manufacturer. And the complex force structure elements can be included in the super element. The dynamic response of the jacket, including such elements, can be included in the bladed simulations. However, there are also some disadvantages of adopting a super element approach. The hydroelastic coupling between sports structure and waves is not taken into account, as wave loads must be specified as a simulation input. Time domain simulation is required in both bladed and uh, SESAM in order to determine the interior jacket loads, which involves some duplication of the simulation. Overall, system optimization is easier in a fully coupled analysis. As any simulation tool, bladed and SESAM make various different modeling and analysis assumptions for the structure and its environment. DNV has carried out a verification study, which confirms that the conversions provided by SESAM to and from Bladed have been performed properly, both the integrated model, the super element model, and the loads and for the results. The results of the methods give comparable results for sports fracture loads and kinematics. Visit our website to download a copy of DME's verification report and learn how our solutions can help you and your organization to maximize design efficiency and minimize costs in fixed offshore business. Thanks for watching.